Hi, this is Dr. Divanes Raja. Now I will discuss about the pharmacology of the alpha methyl dopa. The alpha methyl dopa is centrally acting adrenergic drug. This is a centrally acting adrenergic drug. Okay. It decreases central adrenergic outflow. Decreases decreases central adrenergic outflow. Outflow from the brain stem. Okay, we got that. It decreases peripheral resistance. It decreases peripheral resistance. Okay. But it does not disturb the heart rate and cardiac output. Does not decrease the cardiac output and heart rate. Cardiac output and heart rate. Okay, we got that. This is an antihypertensive drug. Okay, this is. Then you have to know that it does not decrease blood flow, decrease renal blood flow. Okay. Therefore, this drug is a good drug to manage a patient with hypertension and renal failure. Okay. Used in the management of hypertension with renal failure okay we got that but its use is now almost obsolete in the management of hypertension because with a better drug the clonidine is present so its use is limited under certain circumstances where clonidine and other drug are not useful or contraindicated used in the management of hypertension with renal failure so that is a therapeutic use here so we got that the therapeutic application therapeutic application of alpha methyl dopa therapeutic application okay that is the management of hypertension. We we'll also use another use, use in the management of pregnancy related hypertension, management of pregnancy related hypertension. Okay, so both way in case of renal failure, it is a good drug with hypertension. In case of pregnancy associated hypertension, like preeclampsia, we then alpha methyl dopa is a good medication for those patients. Okay, we got that. Now we'll go to the adverse effects of 
alpha methyl dopa. Okay. Also, one more important point is that it can be used in pregnancy. It does not cause congenital birth defect. It is not teratogenic. Okay. So, it can be used in a pregnant woman without any concern for the fetus or baby. Okay. Now, we'll go to the adverse effects. Again, it may cause orthostatic hypertension, especially in the elderly people, but it, it will cause mostly sedation, dryness of mouth, vertigo, sexual dysfunction, Especially in the male, okay, sexual dysfunction, okay, these are the possible adverse effect. Then we give emphasis on positive Coombs test, positive Coombs test, okay, in around approximately around 15 to 20 percent patients okay that positive Coombs test may be may, may not may be disturbing to do the cross matching for blood transfusion okay so it may lead to hemolytic anemia hemolytic anemia there is a very common condition okay, with that of the alpha methyl dopa another based in very important point it may lead to hepatitis or liver damage okay, there is very common condition so there may be hepatitis or liver damage that is an anomaly that is the adverse effect of the alpha methyl dopa okay so we got alpha methyl dopa therapeutic use and adverse effect and it is not contraindicated during pregnancy rather it is managed in a patient pregnant patient with hypertension Okay, so that's all about the alpha methyl dopa. If you like my video, please support my channel. Please subscribe me. Have a nice day. Bye now.